Hey everybody, this is Joe with EFI, and this is the second in our series of videos highlighting the new features of our latest and greatest release of Digital Storefront, version 9. Today, we're focusing on improvements and changes made to our EFI VDP module for Digital Storefront. With $45 billion spent annually on direct mail around the world, print remains the number one single expenditure when it comes to marketing. This makes direct mail a great opportunity for print service providers. But the processes around mail list handling and mailing can be daunting, especially for print providers looking to make the jump into these kinds of services. All the manual steps and expertise needed are a barrier to entry and can eat into profitability. Not so with the DSF direct mail automated workflow, where we cut those manual steps down to two. Your customer submits the direct mail order and we take care of the rest. The EFI VDP templates module for Digital Storefront, powered by our Direct Smile technology, brings together easy to use e-commerce and powerful variable data composition. And on top of it, we're adding automated mail list processing and postage calculation that makes it easy for you to offer direct mail services to your customers regardless of your level of expertise with mailing. And now, with Digital Storefront 9, we've expanded to include Every Door Direct Mail, or EDDM, with an easy-to-use geomapping selection process making it simple for your customers to blanket their target geographical areas at a great rate. Let's have a look. So here we are in a Digital Storefront storefront, and let's go to this postcard product for Crash Course Motors. First choice we're making is between single mode and batch mode. We'll select batch mode and then we'll say, in this case, that we want to upload a variable data source or a mailing list. We'll supply the list. Here, I'll pick this file here. And then upload that file. The system imports those records and is going to show us those here on screen. And I'll go to the next step where I'm mapping the columns in my data source to the columns or the variables in my template. From there, we'll go onto the screen where we make all of our settings for the mail list handling in terms of CAS certification, the national change of address track, removal of duplicates, the mailing service class, and even the mailing date that we'll select here. And then when I've done that, I'll click process list and through our integration with a great partner of ours, AccuZip, for mail list handling, we'll do all these things. We'll automatically remove all the duplicates. We'll check to make sure that these are valid addresses and check to make sure, uh, th see if there's been any change uh, in the addresses. Once we're done with that, we'll pre-sort the addresses and we'll get back an actual postage cost based on the number of deliverable records. From there, we'll go on to mapping the columns in the data to the template. And now, we're setting all of the things that are going to be the same on each postcard. And we're using a feature here in Digital Storefront called uh, Dynamic Web Fields. And here we see our proof. I'll zoom in and we'll see our data applied here, our intelligent mail barcode already generated, everything ready to go for the mailing process. Now I want to take a chance to show you the Every Door Direct Mailing feature uh, new with Digital Storefront 9 and its geographic selection. So I'll choose Use EDDM. And this is a great feature. Uh, EDDM is a way for marketers to reach large areas, everybody in that area, all residents, all businesses at a great rate. So here, using the geographic selector, I'll put in a zip code that everybody knows. And here on the map, I can simply click to select various carrier routes. And notice that the individual routes selected is showing me how many there are, the number of residential deliveries here, the number of business deliveries. And then, when we proceed from there, I can move over to another area of the map and add more to that. So it's really a flexible way and an easy way for your customers to blanket an area for their direct mailing efforts. And from here, Continuing on with the automation this module provides, on the back end for the mailing, Digital Storefront will generate the mail.dat file and all the paperwork required by the post office for this direct mail job. So you can see from here that 
the new features that are part of the EFI VDP templates module uh, can really help automate things when you're getting into mailing. Thanks for joining us. Follow the link in the email that you received to join us for our Digital Storefront 9 webinar to find out more.